Hello to all our lovely patients at Not Just Backs, it's Rianne here. I just want to update you on what's going on at our practice at the moment. Um, so, for current patients, we are phoning you the day before your appointment. We are pre-screening you and we want to make sure that you are fit and healthy to come in to see us. So we ask that in the morning of your appointment that you feel well, you don't have a temperature, um, you don't have any coughs and colds, and this applies to your family as well. You have to stay in if your family are feeling ill as well. So you just phone up and cancel your appointment on the day. That is fine. Um, for our Salisbury patients, what we ask you to do if you're coming by car is you remain in your car. We will call you when your appointment is ready and you can come in, gel your hands and then go straight into the treatment room. This way we can reduce our waiting room contact with other people. For Tisbury, uh, we have seats outside, but it's less busy in Tisbury, so you're less likely to have that issue. Um, we also ask, it's a bit weird this one, that you spend your penny before you come to the practice. We are trying just to limit our toilet facilities. Um, this is just because we, like yourself, it's hard to find toilet roll and obviously hand drying um, tissue paper and also just for the spread of the virus itself. Um, so please have a wee at home before you come. Thank you. Uh, obviously you can use our facilities though if you are desperate when we have to go, we have to go. Um, we also ask that you try and pay by card because this stops us having to go to the bank and again, limiting contacts with other people. Um, we uh, also ask that you do not turn up um, before five minutes before your appointment's gonna start as well. Wilton next week, uh, the practice, the GP practice there is shut. So we will not be operating from Wilton, but Francis and Tom will be working in Salisbury instead at Extra Street. So uh, a few little tips before I go. Um, in these times of stress, which we are all under, not one of us is not going to feel this pressure at this time. Um, people tend to either do two things with their diet. They either eat lots of chocolate and, and all sorts of sugary foods and high carbohydrate foods, or they go the opposite and don't eat much at all. So try and keep your diet to a nice varied diet, obviously including lots of your lovely vegetables of all the colors of the rainbow. If you can uh, cook like that, that's great. And also just to let you know, we have a daily exercise um, plan on our Facebook page. So if you want to come and join us, you are more than welcome. It's just 10 minutes a day uh, and uh, you do the same thing every day for a week and then we change the video and you do different exercises the following week. So if you want to join that, you are more than welcome. It's called Not Just Backs Daily Exercises. You click on that, you ask to join and I will let you come on in and join the, join the group. They're really friendly. Um, and the other thing is just be careful of your distancing from people. People are getting still too close. Um, keep away in the supermarkets. Think about your space between you and the next person. When you're going to school, you know, the last couple of days to pick up your children, stay away from people, keep that meter apart. Everybody's still really close. So just think about your distance from, from each other. We want to stay safe in this time. So. Look after yourselves and if we're not seeing you really soon, hopefully see you at some point in the future when this is all over. Nice to see you. Cheerio.